If it isn't my intellectual sparring partner, I see you brought Albert a copy of Plato's Republic. Petty stuff. I haven't read it, but Albert was sure excited. If it has pages, Albert's excited. But here's a question. If you had to make a choice, would you choose to be just or to be happy? I choose both. Who said we had to choose in the first place? But that's the point of the exercise, to make a choice. You're not playing fair. That's not very just. Albert's shelves are nearly full. I suppose you'll stop visiting soon. We'll just have to see about that. Well, at least there's one more location to check. Renegades killed a group of children! Who stopped those monsters?
Here you are. This will make Albert happy. You! Give us that book. Why, this book? What's it to you? Because it contains a treasure map. Uh, look, I think you're confused. It's called Treasure Island, and it may show a picture of a treasure map, but it's not real. That's not what we hear. Now hand it over. It's not gonna happen. Then we'll take it from you. We're good at that. Plunder of boys. A treasure in Treasure Island. <laughs> Idiots. Wait, what's this? Looks like a um, safe combination? I'll be damned. It was a treasure map. Well, of sorts. Luckily, the book is the only treasure Albert's looking for.
Our chances against renegades were pretty good, but now I'm not so sure. I'm around if you need me, friend. It's like Christmas every time you return. Almost everything you think you know about pirates comes from Robert Louis Stevenson's book, Treasure Island. But did you know it was originally meant as a coming of age story? Indeed. And even though it was for children, many pirate movies, when there were movies, were rated R. Duh, you, sir. For a tough audience. Darwin's Origin of the Species is the foundation of evolutionary biology. It's ironic, really. Is what's happening around us somehow an expression of Darwin's natural selection? Unnatural selection, if you ask me. You did it, Aiden. Our work here is done for now. I am humbled. Truly, I am. Humanity has a chance to survive. Not just in body, but in spirit. Because of you. Take this. It is but a pittance for all your great works. But it may serve you in your daily adventures. Thank you, Albert. But I'm curious. What will you do now that your collection's complete? Hmm. With our literary past safeguarded, there is only one thing to do, my boy. What's that? Secure the future, of course. Ensure the human spirit continues to be distilled for ages to come. So, write more books? Precisely. Starting with a record of your heroic deeds that brought us to this moment. Who would want to read about me? After I've told your tale, my boy, everyone. Oh, and it will be epic. And I already have a title. Libros Libertad. Nice. Now leave me, for I must begin. Thank you again, Aiden. We are all in your debt. Oh, and check up on Thalia. She wanted to talk to you. Keep well, Albert. <laughs> 